Well, hello, and welcome to a thrilling tutorial, th just thrilling, on how to track audio levels in Avid Media Composer within your timeline. Um, I was asked this the other day, um, and I am doing something. Uh, if you watch these tutorials, all five of you, um, if you have an idea or have a question on something, just send me a comment. Let me know. I'll be happy to um, see if I can help you um, with your problem. Because I really, guys, I, this isn't like my, you know, I don't make tutorials for a living. I don't think anybody really does. Maybe somebody does. I don't know. I just do it. I don't know why I do this, honestly. It's kind of a waste of my time. But hopefully it helps a lonely editor out there. All right, so first, uh, enough of that minute of talking. First, we're going to just simply... Um, you have to show your track control panel within your timeline here, your sequence. So down here on the hamburger menu, fast menu, you do a, say track control panel. Click on that. All these wonderful details will show up here. And you simply turn on the volume, set it to active. And then for me, I don't know what your quick key would be, but for me, I just set it to P. I think P was a. Um, um, it used to be what you would do in Adobe. So yeah, so I just kind of transferred that over and then you can highlight those, um, which is a alt drag is what I do, right? Yeah, and then I just select them and I can go up and down. As you can see on the bottom left down here, it tells you um, how high or low you're going with those. Um, so we'll just say five, 0.47 and then there you go it's nice and tracked that's essentially it and if you want to go further down you know you can set more keyframes more keyframes and just you know have a blast I mean just really have fun I mean look at all that look how fun this is you guys it's like a roller coaster of audio levels going on here really great all right hope this was helpful enlightening um, it's mostly probably just boring. I mean, nobody wants to listen to me talking. Yet I'm sitting here talking. I've had a lot of really great comments from you guys. Last comment I had was, I think, boring. I think that was it. Yeah, all right.